Hello everyone. Good morning guys, good morning dreamers, and even good morning to the drifters. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Dreaming with Drifters. Taking you guys on an exclusive journey today, not going very far, not leaving the mountain. However, this is your very first time coming across the rocky road. <laughs> Let's feel it. too bad not all that great but not too bad but mm. we didn't get stuck and we didn't get stuck yeah <laughs> that's what I'm talking about that's what I'm talking about got a couple of things we're rolling with this morning our first mission is I am going to finally finally be taking Uncle David's metal bed frame to his house. Finally! <laughs> uh, I'm actually going to be putting it over there in the boneyard. Uncle David actually took all three of the kids to go get ice cream yep. and lunch. And some lunch, yep. yep. Because they all got A's on their report cards. Yep. I think actually uh, Serenity and Talon had straight A's and Jacob had uh, some B's, but he had A's and B's, I believe. Oh, don't forget to get yourself in the screen, my queen. Speaking of queen, I, I got see. short arms, so it's hard for me to like hold it but out. <laughs> rotate, but yeah, rotate the camera. Yeah, rotate it more in towards you. There you go. And then, and then you can see it. You know, rotate it until you're in. I'll lean in. I can gangster lean. <laughs> Don't worry. We're right here in the driveway. We're not going far, y'all. Do have our seat belts on, so I don't have to hear the ding, 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 ding. I don't know how to turn it off yet. Well, I don't have my seatbelt on because, again, we're just going down to the end of the driveway. Yeah. <laughs> oh, leaving Drifter's Lane. This is what we call headed up the mountain. Headed up the mountain. I guess I could have asked Uncle David where he wanted this metal bed frame. Oh. Oh, in the bone yard, it will be out of the way. Yeah, yeah. I know. I mean, and it's not heavy, so. Yeah, I know he wants it in the bone yard, but you know what is what is what is gimped up wrist and elbow right now. He's you know I don't want to have to make a move too many things. <laughs> All right, bone yard. Starting to. Starting to look like a little something over here. <laughs> He's done. Gathered himself a few things. Oh, well, those trusses are ours. I was so. just about to say, look, those are <laughs> those are our stuff. That's our truck. I think we might end up building a barn out of those. A bizarre. Or a Lissa's Crafty Meditation Shack. <laughs> you got it or you want me to help? Um, yeah, here. You guys come sit over here. Come sit over here on the trailer. sit right there we'll be right back we're just gonna go put this down we'll be you just sit right there
You guys hear the dogs? I can see the the roof down there. Yep. So we do have something else for you this morning. I hear Odin. We're getting ready to go down here to the wild. To the Krizik. And to some of y'all, to the Crick. <laughs> some people call, some people say uh, Crick instead of Creek. Mm -hmm. You know? I did not know. Yeah? My Aunt Tanya? Hey, Aunt Tanya. <laughs> and over there in Kentucky, they say Crick. <laughs> You know, and they, they also say pop. Our Midwestern friends, too. Well, why are we going down to the creek? We're going to the creek because it was time to wash some of our spoils. It's time to wash our treasure off. Not the big ones, though, guys. I think we're going to take that to a car wash yeah. with your plan? Yeah, we're going to take those to the car wash first. <laughs> I think that's a good idea. We are about to go down here to, uh, back to Dreamer's Landing, where the two small, uh, where the small creek meets the big creek, to our little, our little hangout area down here for Lisa and myself. <laughs> and we're going to be washing all the dirt off as best as we can um, from the smaller crystals and getting them ready uh, and prepped up for their acid bath. We did purchase some kind of uh, some kind of acid that we're going to be uh, putting in a the directions say to put the crystals in a, a metal like a metal pot right and then um, put the crystals in it and fill it up with the water and then put the acid in it and then we're supposed to boil it right outside outside so. That ought to be interesting. <laughs> and then for the bigger ones, we're just gonna take them to the car wash and uh, and clean them up as best we can. And then whatever is left over from our acid wash, probably somehow try to try to, to do I don't that. Know, try to do something. I don't know. I'm just gonna. I wonder if they would mind if we just park in the middle of the road right here. <laughs> I think they'll be okay with it. I think the owners won't mind. <laughs> Let's go! To the Krizzy! I'm also going to be taking, taking the battery and the pump uh, back up towards the other side of the creek. And we're going to be pumping some water back into... And to the storage tanks, it's time to fill up our water storage, huh? Yep. Here, you want, I'll grab that if you want. You want to hold the camera? Hey, you guys be careful stepping over this. Kind of steep. <laughs> Nice little uh, home base for us. Oh, you dropped your phone. Yeah. Be a nice little home base. Yeah. Go ahead and throw you guys on a pause real quick. We're gonna set up and we'll be right back. Okay. We've got some things set up for us here. Let me adjust the camera real quick. Okay. So we've got our bigger, our bigger, smaller pieces of quartz. And you can see it right here. This is some really nice quartz. And these are the bigger of the smaller pieces. And Lissa has, we got a couple of smaller brushes here. Oh yeah, look at these guys. A bunch of smaller ones. So. That's nice. Yeah, we got a, a whole bucket load. Not a whole bucket load, but you know, we got a whole bunch of different ones in here. 
I know some of you are like, well, why would they keep this, this really teeny tiny ones? Well, guys, I like to use these in like my candles and my crafts and just, I like to wear them and carry them and right. there's lots of reasons. So yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Different crystals have different properties and stuff, different kinds of energies. Mm -hmm. And then we got a, a couple of trays over here yeah, with some ones that we're going to be starting with. Look at that. It's like a milky quartz. So we're going to be focused on getting the dirt off. We'll probably just pick a nice little spot right here where the water's flowing. Wherever you want to set up, baby. And I'll just put the camera down and you guys can hang out for a little bit and check us out. Let's see what Lissa's going to be doing. I'm going to be doing the same thing, but... He's already washing off a lot of this stuff. Nice. Yeah, our main, our, our goal here uh, today is going to be getting the dirt off of them. As much dirt as we can, anyway. Guys, I don't know if this is how you do it. This is just the way I chose to do it. All right. like Michael said, right now we're just trying to clean them up a little better. Try to get a lot of this dirt off of it. And then later we'll... We'll give it that, that acid bath that right. we bought that came with it. I know uh, Iron Out is what everybody recommended on the last video. Oh yeah, that looks wonderful. <laughs> Remember, guys, we are not professionals. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm a professional. <laughs> Y'all already know I'm a professional. And a lot of you guessed what I was going to do with these crystals. A bunch of these will be going into my gardens and fairy garden and things like that. These bigger ones. So the I think, water doesn't feel too cool, cold, actually. What was it? The water doesn't feel too cold. Yeah. I mean, it's cool, but... So what uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and do is just set you guys up on a pause. And, uh, and that way we'll bring you back in just a little bit and show you our progress. I don't want to stop it because here with Dreaming with Drifters, these are unedited vlogs. Um, we're just filming and uploading right here. This is raw and uncut. But this may take some time, and I know that you guys probably don't want to sit here and watch us just scrub these crystals with brushes. So uh, we'll get a couple good and clean for you guys, and then we'll come back. We'll be, we'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. <laughs> it's mad. All right, Lissa wants to show you something super awesome. guys see how clear that is if you stand on the other side of it maybe you can look at the screen and you can see what you're just if you're too close or too far away mm, 
that, guys. I think we call this a milky quartz. Remember, we're still going to give it that acid bath to get all this, like, orange stain out of it. I guess you could see what we're going to be doing for a little bit. We're going to go ahead and get this done. We still got these bigger ones going. Lissa's been down here working on this really nice big one right here. Look at that. Yeah, that's awesome. And then with the acid bath, you know, it'll bring all that, uh, orange stuff that out. orange, that orange, uh, clay, you know, off of it and stuff like that. But for now, I guess we're going to go ahead and wrap it up here. I'm going to get back to the house and get this uploaded for you so y'all can see what's happening today. <sighs> you guys can catch the rest of this on DD5. Oh, nice. So tomorrow, you'll be able to see the rest of the cleaning and uh, and what it looked like while we went and picked all this stuff up, I guess. Yeah. Yay, nice. <laughs> all right, well, we'll catch y'all tomorrow over on Drifting Dreamers 5, and we'll catch you tomorrow on Dreaming with Drifters. Have a great day, guys. I hope, don't forget, we go live tomorrow on Fridays, every day, 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. I hope we can see you there. Bye. Bye. Going from this to this.